What is going on everybody? It is Master Wolf here. Welcome back to a brand new Clash of Clans video and welcome back to my Ovi No Gems trolling base, uh, which is Town Hall 10 and just a load of fun and a load of cool base designs uh, to be made. Today we are focusing on the brand new Halloween update. First of all, you can see I actually have a Halloween headstone in this, uh, in this little base design, which is pretty cool. But this is all focused on these new skeleton traps. So we've got three level three skeleton traps all set to uh, ground. So these are all set to ground troops. And basically what I set it as is the white flag is here. So people spawn at this white flag at this and they have to tackle through three lots of skeleton traps to get to it. Uh, there is a builder's hut here so it lures them in. Otherwise they do get lured around the outside. Uh, this actually hasn't had as much effect as I wanted. I thought initially when I first used uh, the skeleton traps, they were really, really powerful. But doing this uh, little exercise with this uh, trolling base, I found they're not so uh, it's not not so amazing as I initially thought. So I've got four replays to show you today. Uh, luckily, this guy actually understood that you spawn at the white flag. I've had troubles with the other ones where they've spawned and tried to take it from uh, from behind over here, and uh, it just hasn't worked for them. So let's see how this goes. So he first spawns up a load of barbarians. These are level 4 Barbarians, so they're pretty high level. I actually wanted really low level troops to come at me to, uh, to see how well they did against that. But as you can see, the Barbarians just tear through um, my Skeletons. So you can remember I've got three traps and my last trap is here. So they take out the Builders Hut and now they are going for the Town Hall. But up plot my Skeletons and the Skeletons jump around the back. They love to go around the back. Uh, and start trying to take them out. And they actually do pretty well. They lose a lot of health, these barbarians. But they get through and they are able to take out the town hall happily without any problems. So thank you. I can't read that name, some squiggly language, for taking on my base and actually playing it properly. And he beat the skeletons really easily. Now this is where it starts to get interesting. Because some people uh, obviously believe that this does not mean spawn here and you'll be safe. This means bad, do not spawn here. And they wanna spawn like, oh, if I spawn here or around here, I'll be able to take out this base. Now I actually had to redesign this a few times, uh, but this is what happens. So first of all, this guy spawns up, where does he spawn them? So he, oh, okay, this guy actually goes for my stuff over here. Uh, and he spawns his giants in the center. Now, as you can see, they start getting a lot of hits on them. Uh, my troops come out of the clan castle to come and take some action as well. Uh, but the giants start tearing through my base. So this guy is completely ignoring the fact that this is meant to be a trolling uh, base. And he's just gone, you know what, I'm going to try and wreck this guy's base. Which he should be able to, to be honest. Because, let's be honest, the base is not set up uh, to defend well. It's set up for fun. It's set up for people to play the game. Uh, which this guy clearly does not want to do, which is absolutely fine. Uh, but his giants start getting destroyed. I think all his giants die in the end, actually. But as you can see, he starts spawning troops around the outside to try and take out the town hall. Uh, which isn't working for him at the moment. He's still going around with his giants, destroying all the stuff here, taking a little bit of loot. But I'm not going to lie, there's hardly any loot. And, you know, he's used a lot of troops for this, which really, really surprised me. Uh, and I feel is a waste for him. But, you know, if that's, if that's what he wanted to do, that's absolutely fine. So the archers take out the final bit of the gold storage here, and that is that. He ignored the fact that this was going to be a fun troll base, and he did what he wanted, which is fine, but it was a waste of, uh, he probably didn't even make enough, enough elixir to do that. Alright, so this guy here actually spawns on the outside. For some reason, he spawns right next to a wizard tower. Do not ask me why. Uh, the wizard tower is able to destroy him like an absolute boss. The barbarians just drop. The uh, tesla also pops up and does a bit of damage. Which is pretty cool. But now all the archers run forward and get ready for this. Boom, boom, boom. And they're gone. They've been hit by a bomb. Uh, and we only have a few of the archers left. He throws a few more in. And they start getting hit down as well. Uh, which is really annoying because he ignored this attack strategy. Everybody seems to be ignoring it. And the archers just drop the town hall. So this is why this really failed. And at this point I was like, you know what? I need to change this around. So I completely changed it for this final attack. Um, and it actually, this guy actually went for it like he should. So here we go. As you can see here. Again, it's, uh, it's changed. So now he's spawned here. The Teslas pop up. There's two wizard towers on this side. Uh, and there's also this wizard tower covering up here. So you can't really spawn uh, without getting killed. So he spawns up his first few troops. Again, boom, goodbye. Tesla towers pop up. We're all nicely covered. And then he's like, you know what? I'm going to play this game uh, smart. I'm going to play it how, how this guy obviously has set up his base. So my troops from my clan castle come out, which give a little bit of help. He spawns them up. And here we go. Out come the skeletons to try and attack them and try and take some of the damage down. Now, my barbarians, I believe, are level 2, uh, which are no good at all. Here's a level 3. So his are a lot more powerful. So they drop my skeletons and they drop my bar barbarians quite quickly. We've got a couple of skeletons left in here, but it's just an absolute 
masterpiece of disaster in here. Uh, so he goes forward, up come the skeletons, out the skeleton trap, start trying to take down some of these barbarians, but they're really not powerful enough. I think you need to use them as in a pact of three. Trying to use them separately like I'm using here does not seem to work. Even when the barbarians run away and come back, he's able to take them out. So guys, that is the skeleton trap troll base. The skeletons are not powerful enough to set up their own troll base, which is a real shame. Because uh, it would have been really cool if they could have fought some enemies all together. Maybe if we put them all together, we would have had a little bit more luck. Uh, but that's definitely for another video. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please do smash the like button down below and comment any other ideas you have for troll bases. And you ninja viewers out there, make sure you hit the like button down below and comment. It's been great seeing you all in the comment section recently and I do want to see you there more, uh, which will be really, really cool. But until next time, guys, thank you so much for watching. Peace out.